Have you ever heard of a weapon that can make you feel like your skin is on fire, but without actually burning you? It sounds like something straight out of a science fiction movie, right? But this isn't Hollywood magic. It's a real piece of military technology developed by the United States. It's called the Active Denial System, or ADS. So what exactly is this thing? Imagine a satellite dish mounted on a truck. This dish doesn't broadcast TV signals. It projects a focused beam of millimeter wave radiation. That is a fancy way of saying it sends out a type of energy similar to what your microwave uses, but much, much less powerful and at a different frequency. When this invisible beam hits a person, it excites the water and fat molecules just under the surface of their skin. It penetrates only about 1 64th of an inch deep, but it rapidly heats this tiny layer, creating an intense, intolerable heating sensation. The feeling is so overwhelming that the natural, instinctual reaction is to immediately move out of the beam's path. It's an instant get out of the way button. Military officials describe the sensation as similar to opening a very hot oven door and feeling that blast of heat. Critically, as soon as the person moves out of the beam or the operator turns it off, the sensation disappears instantly, leaving no injury, no burn, and no lasting damage. It's designed to be a non-lethal crowd control weapon, a way to disperse unruly crowds or stop potential threats without resorting to deadly force. The idea is to give soldiers a way to de-escalate a dangerous situation. Instead of bullets or tear gas, they can create a repel field that people simply can't stand to be in. The system can target individuals from up to a thousand meters away, making it a surprisingly precise tool for managing chaotic environments from a safe distance. It's a fascinating and slightly terrifying glimpse into the future of non-lethal warfare. While it has been deployed to places like Afghanistan, its use in actual combat or crowd control situations has been extremely limited, partly due to concerns about public perception. After all, calling it a pain ray doesn't exactly make for great PR. The technology is real, it's effective, and it forces us to rethink what a weapon can even be. Want to know more mind-blowing military facts? Then check out my other videos.